Hello, I'm Olumide McCauley. Here's a Channel's Television morning news update for July the 26th, 2020. COVID-19 cases in Nigeria closed in on 40,000 on Saturday after the country recorded 438 new cases and 11 deaths. A breakdown of the new cases confirmed by the Nigeria Center for Disease Control shows that Lagos recorded 123 new cases, with Kaduna State trailing with 50 cases. So far, 16,948 of those infected in Nigeria have been discharged, while 856 of the infected have sadly died, with 22,173 others still battling the virus. Meanwhile, the Nigeria Association of Resident Doctors on Saturday said it will resume its suspended nationwide strike in three weeks if the federal government fails to meet its demands. The president of the association disclosed this to newsmen at a press conference in Abuja. NAD had on June the 22nd suspended its nationwide strike after a virtual meeting of over 300 of its members. The leader at the time said the association suspended the strike in order to give the federal and state governments time to fulfill its outstanding demands. In Kaduna, policemen on Saturday dispersed members of the Islamic movement in Nigeria as they gathered in Kaduna to commemorate the sixth anniversary of the alleged killing of some of their members by the Nigerian army on July 25, 2014. IMN spokesperson Ibrahim Musa told Channel Television that the commemoration was a peaceful annual event usually observed with members gathering to offer prayers for the repose of the souls of their departed members. On the international scene, the Catalan government on Friday ordered the closure of all nightclubs, discos and event halls across the region of northeastern Spain following a surge in cases of coronavirus. The order, which came into effect on Saturday and remains in force for two weeks, was given as Spain watches more than 280 new outbreaks with virus cases tripling in the past fortnight. And in sports, AC Milan striker Vlatan Ibrahimovic has ruled out hanging up his boots after the season, insisting on Saturday he's just warming up. The 38-year-old, in a dramatic video posted on Instagram, said those who think his career will soon be over do not know him. And that's the morning news update. Don't forget to join us later for the evening recap. I'm Olumide Mukoli. Thank you for watching.